Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Movie Social. We are your hosts, Ricky and Stefan. Hello, my people. All right, today's episode, we're going to talk about the Apple TV Plus original Greyhound. Don't forget to uh, like and subscribe, turn on those uh, notifications, and comment below. All right. I'm just saying. If they like the channel, subscribe. And if they uh, like our review here, let us know what y'all thought about the movie as well. If you sounds watched like it. it. Sounds like a point. Now, this will be a spoiler review. All right, let's get this over with a quick, fast and heavy. This cannot keep you guys uh, waiting. All right, so, boom. It stars Tom Hanks. Greyhound, bruh. So, I'm just going to divulge into it just, just a little, little, uh, just for a moment. I love this movie. Um, because it showed the thought process, the strategy, the smarts, the jargon of an actual battle in war on the seas. Now, you normally, this like I, I can't remember many movies when it comes to military that you've seen on the seas, like Pearl Harbor, but that was like planes was, was associated. But this was like... Uh, you gotta watch uh, Midway, then. All right, so this was like Battleship, the game that you played back mm -hmm. in the yeah, day that, really as a kid. It. Mind you, they did turn that into a movie. Yeah. That's neither here nor there because we need to redo that movie and I would keep directed to it. Guys but it. they did battle, it was like a battleship and it, it, it was so good, like the jargon and the communication lines and like, like everything about this movie show, like the, the, the casting was with Tom Hanks to me was great in this role. Um, as Captain Cruz, Krause, whatever you want, how you want to pronounce his last name. Um, and like the cinematographer for like the, the like outside shots of the boat, um, it turning on the water, um, like on a dime. Like normally I never knew that boats could turn that fast, mm -hmm. but I'm pretty sure that they, the reason why they can turn it because they're war boats. And it so, also depends on what's being used and everything. And to me, it, for the most part, I don't believe they turn as fast as they did in the movie. It's just slightly, maybe just a tad bit slower. Because it depends on two on the sides of the boat as well. True. But see, they, they you can tell their boat was like legitly a war boat. Yeah, no, don't forget, this is also set in World War II. Okay. Time frame. Yes, yes, most definitely. But like I said, they from the outside, when they did the, shot, the shots of the outside boat when it was turning, it looks as if that thing is turning. Like, like not as fast as a car, obviously. But it looks like it's turning a lot faster than you would think a boat would turn. Two, they also they had to turn fast for us. It's turn fast to be sunk. <laughs> that, that is true. That is true. <laughs> Them torpedoes was coming fast and in a hurry. Yeah, and it, it was just a great, great movie from start to finish. It's only, what, an hour and a half? Hour and 45 minutes? Something like that? Closer to two hours. Hour and 45 minutes. I, I could have swore it was an hour and a half, but... Nope. I probably was so ingrained in the jargon of it and like the communications with like the person downstairs looking at the rate, the, the snow sonars and the person over there trying to figure yeah. out what trajectory the torpedoes is coming from and how far out and that see, it shows blew you my too, mind. It shows you how far back technology was yes. compared to now. Cause it's a whole nother animal out there for wars now. I agree, like I believe then. I believe so he couldn't see at night. They really yeah. couldn't see them at night, and mm -hmm. that's when the worst parts were coming in at. Yep. And also, if you think about it, right, war today versus yesteryear, mm -hmm. I feel like we had to be a lot more knowledgeable about math. Yeah, you had to definitely be. Um, I mean, you still do now. Yeah, but anything can go down. Yeah, but I feel like it, it was more prominent back then. Uh, of course, because you didn't have the technology, so you had to basically know and navigate and memorize a lot of stuff. He was using the, uh, what is those called? The co contractors? Protractors. Protractors. Protractors and, like, spinning around, yeah. measuring it out. It was dope. To. It was so dope. It was so dope. Your thoughts? I mean, as a whole, it was good. I mean, I would say the first 45 minutes wasn't really action. It was more so talking, getting back started, getting a sense of the movie itself. 
Some people might find that uh, sluggish. Some people might not. To me, it was okay. The act, the second half of the movie was all action. It was as a whole, the movie was great. Yes, the scenes at night were a little hard to see at times, but that was more so to give the feel of how it was back then. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Because goddamn, I could not see them uh, subs at all. I'm like, <laughs> they couldn't see them the subs at all time. either. All I could see is the white of Tom Hanks face, and that was it. Couldn't see nothing else. I'm like, hmm. also, brightness up all on the scene. Remember. Yeah. The Germans, when they were like fat, fine, like they so the Germans were sending messages through their speakers, and every time they would change the channel, the Germans would find whatever channel they was on. Yeah. I mean, that's <laughs> how it was back in during those times. But see, I still don't get this. I mean, I know it's stuff from modern, I mean, from back then. One only a handful of ships to defend this whole fleet, yeah, like really. And then you didn't have air support for a while, and luckily when they did get the air support, cause it was yeah, it was about to, it was about to RIP be sleeping with the fishes, mm -hmm. literally. Mm -hmm. And you know how many people died, and and that, that's the bad thing, especially for back then, when if your ship went down, yeah, most times you wasn't getting picked up by somebody else, especially if they were still in the middle of the fight, or you like they showed here, all. if you die on the boat. You just get, they, they have a little quick ceremony mm -hmm. quickly. Well, that's they, they, didn't have, they had no way of keeping them preserved, especially yeah. on this time. They couldn't go back. They couldn't have them airlifted. Yeah, they Nothing had like to, that. They had to, um. So a lot of people's lives were lost. Dumped in the water. And never got a proper burial. Yep. Which is saddening. One of the parts that really was saddening was Cleveland stuff. Yeah, that, that's. He, he was. Because, like, you know, during that Tom time. Tom Hanks was shook. He was definitely shook. Because most. Black men during that time weren't given recognition for anything during the wars, mm -hmm. and they always were hitting behind the scenes. And he wasn't even like a real. They were cooks. Yeah, he was a cook it. because and he then, wasn't allowing them to do. Yeah, anything. he was. So he actually did, like he was. He was a cook, and then when they needed someone to, like mm -hmm. back up, back up, back up. Yeah, they didn't allow most. They allow black people to do certain things. Mm -hmm. That were life threatening more so, but if you to hold any rank, nah, not really. Yeah, well, like, it was shook up because he he really took care of the cat. Like even though like, he, he was like, yo, he didn't eat all day. Captain, what you want to drink? Mm -hmm. and, and this is his, the captain's first first outing. And for it to be his first outing, and for him to kill it the way he killed it, you see how they congratulate him. At yes, man. he killed it, man. He killed it. What was so funny to me, right, is. Doing, I thought something was going to happen to him after he took off his helmet. I thought something was going to happen to him. But like he was like, hey, go down in my quarters and get my coat. And then boy brought his coat. He's like, hey, go put, go put it on the heater for a little bit. Put it on the heater, put that coat on. His feet started, and his feet started to bleed for standing up so long. Mm -hmm. And he was like, go downstairs and get my slippers. This man is manning battle stations, giving out orders and slippers. Mm -hmm. I was like, yo. It happens. It was dope, and I thoroughly enjoyed it. Um, if I had to rate it uh, out of 10, I would definitely give it like an 8 out of 10. I'd Your give fault. it 8 out of 10 as well. I'm not going to give it any lower, no higher. I mean, it was the typical Tom Hanks movie, it's if really, you ask me. It's really, it was really, it really was good. It was good. Great action. Pack. No. Academy, please do not try to put this as Best Picture. It was great and all, but I don't think Best Picture. <laughs> I mean, we, it's Slim Pickens this year. Definitely Slim Pickens. But I'm still not saying best picture worthy. It was great though. All right, people. So don't forget to like, subscribe. And uh, until next time, thank you guys. Peace.